do you hate being not subscribed to my YouTube channel? Yeah, bet you didn't see that come in. But if you want to be subscribed to my own YouTube channel like I am, don't forget to press that button, turn on notifications. If you like the video, drop a like, and then you can see more of my really cool content. Just look at all these happy customers. Okay, now it's time for the real advert. Do you hate being poor? Do you want to be rich like me? Well, go over to Messy Modding Services where you can buy GTA 5 modded accounts, GTA 5 money and rank for PS4, Xbox One and PC. Check their website out in the link below. And if you're having doubts, just look at all these happy customers. So here's what happens. I'm just sitting AFK, minding my own business in my office and you see this guy Saru, however you say that, it kills, st however you say that, and also kills GR10 play. You can see, I can, I spring into life because I see someone killing someone. You can actually see, Saru is level 161, stick to is level 20, and GR10 play is level 8. So we've got a level 161, killing a level 20 and a level 8. I don't think that seems fair. Now we'll go to the map. And I'm um, just scrolling through all the players, and I cannot see this guy. So I do the really cool tactic of going to your TV at spectator players. And it seems like this guy is going in an RC tank on a little killing spree against two defenseless little newbies. So I'm taking my little savage over to try and kill this guy in the tank. I swim down here. And then, all of a sudden, of course, the noobs don't understand what's going on and don't understand that I'm trying to protect them and then they try and kill me because they ugh, they're noobs like, look at this guy but anyway after a, a little while the stick guy he uh he leaves the session and I crash because my engine's dying and my engine dies even more and then I've got to find out a new plan because these goddamn players had to ruin me so I fly around in the buzzard and I see this cops and I spot him I start firing rockets to try and get him of course, as soon as I go to fire a rocket, it locks onto the cops instead of this guy. So, thanks game. This game's stupid. Like, you can't even switch. Like, as soon as I press fire, it just locks straight onto a helicopter. But anyway, I'll get a cheeky little kill on this guy. You need my help. No problem. And because I absolutely hate cops with a passion in this game, I should still go, cops turn blind eye. Which literally doesn't work, she always end up accidentally shooting cops anyway, like what? Anyway, I get another kill, because this guy can't dodge my homing rockets because I'm just too good in a buzzard. Jokes on crap. I'm actually so bad. So you're telling me this guy had explosive ammo the whole time and only now he decides to use it after dying four times already. Literally like, it's like the most useful thing for taking out helicopters and he doesn't even think of using it, so. Gives you a, a quick idea of how smart this guy is. So I'm just checking the playlist now for like, anything, anything interesting really. And when I go back, this guy, he's taking an oppressor, he's just flown away, like, oh my god. Don't run. So I'm going to check the pause menu, see what's going on. I zoom in. This is Guy Irock1337 that he's following. And I've checked the playlist, he's actually a level 9. So uh, we just wait a second, see if this level 161 wants to go kill him. And what do you know? He's killed him. So here's, uh, just in case you didn't see it. And this guy, level 9. And you can actually see he goes and kills another person. Uh, Why does everyone have such hard names for now? But this guy's a level 40 summit. So again, that's kind of a low, a low level as well. But anyway, I'll go and get a jet. And this guy is just waiting in his arcade. So yeah, I think 
he might have went there to hide from me because he saw that in a jet. I don't know. But I was wrong. You can see he actually went out of his um, arcade and now he's back in the Presser Mark II. Now if you're new to this channel, one thing you should know is that I'm absolutely terrible in jets. I literally like only fly them to get like one or two kills and then I just jump out straight away. So I've, I literally don't even practice. So that's why I'm literally missing everything. Now, I don't know about you, but I was actually pretty surprised that I managed to get him out of the, of the oppressor from my laser, because I am so bad. So this is what I mean when I said earlier about jumping out after getting a few kills, because I just prefer fighting on ground really. But um, my jet was also pretty damaged, so it's kind of the smart thing to do. <laughs> anyway, this guy misses like so many shotgun shots. Shotguns are so easy to aim in this game, but he, he misses somehow. So if you want to pay attention to the minimap, you can see his little blip is running into like a like a kind of a garage type place. And so I, I'm prepared because I used to do this trick. I used to just hide in there and just spray out with like a minigun or homing launcher or something as I get closer. His little thing disappears. A little blip. Now, I just thought he might have left or teleported to his apartment or something. So I always forget the RC cars are a thing, but you can actually see it's a little RC car spawning over there. And of course, he comes straight over to me. The explosive shotguns are actually pretty decent for taking out RC cars, I've noticed. I've never really used them before. And the sticky bomb just finished them off. Now if you pay attention to the mini-map, you can see. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. There we go, he leaves his little CO or MC, I can't remember which one he was in. But he leaves that and then goes straight into passive. So, yep, yeah, that's a lovely, lovely bit of justice that we've done now. We put a little griefer in passive. See so him just sitting there, he's typing away. And he calls me a stupid hacker. Because, I think it's, it wasn't even sniping him, it wasn't even like, maybe he could accuse me of aimbot, maybe he could, he could accuse me of... I don't know, there's nothing really that he could actually accuse me of. But this guy, being PC as well, everyone just accuses everyone else of hacking. Love to see it. And then he says, don't use mod, you not skills. Nice English there, but I'm guessing he's saying that I use mod instead of skill. Again, still not really sure which part of the fight he was on about. And here it says, I teleported. Not sure when I teleported in this fight, but sure. And then I was just sitting in this session for a while, probably about, I don't know really, but I was just doing like other stuff. I was trying to get a shooting engine in my 
shooting range in my bunker, so I could unlock the platinum tents and stuff for guns. But um, he didn't actually leave the session, he stayed here, just impassive, and he didn't do anything bad anymore. So, yeah, put a little griefer, I guess, in his place. Love to see it. If you'd like to see more stuff like that, don't forget to subscribe, yeah? Because uh, I do upload this stuff quite often.